In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to play NBA 2023 with a PS4 controller on PC. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to properly set up your PS4 controller if you own NBA 2023 on Steam. As you can see on the store page for the game, they list the game as having full controller support. What this means is that the game is going to natively detect and work with any brand of controller that you have, Xbox, PlayStation, and even generic controllers. However, a lot of users have experienced issues, so in this video I'm going to show you two workarounds that you can use to properly set up your controller if you are encountering issues. First, go to your library and select NBA 2023. As you can notice, I don't actually have the game on this account, so I'm just going to show you the process with Call of Duty Warzone, but keep in mind that this will work. Just make sure to select NBA from your library. After you select the game, click this little icon over here to the right side of your screen to access the properties. Within the properties, go into the controller settings and, first, make sure that Steam Input is enabled. Try the game using Steam Input enabled and double check to see if PlayStation has Steam Input enabled. If this doesn't work, you can also try the opposite. You can also try disabling Steam Input and restarting the game. This works for some users and maybe if this solves your issue, you don't have to do anything else. Alternatively, you can also click the controller general settings and just double check to see if Steam input is enabled for PlayStation controllers. You can go ahead and begin testing your inputs over here at the top, just make sure that all the buttons on your controller are working, and if Steam input for PlayStation is enabled and your controller is being detected, you should be able to go into the key binds inside of the game and change everything related to your controller. Like I said, play around with the settings and disable or enable Steam input accordingly. If this doesn't solve your issue, the only workaround that I have is using DS4 Windows. I'm not going to go over the full process in this video because it is a little bit complex, but this is a free tool that you can download to properly set up your DualShock controller and play any game using it. You will be able to download the tool and manually set each button on your controller to do a specific action in game. You can also find templates made by the community if necessary, and it is a very great tool to have if you own a PS4 controller, but it is a little bit extensive. I hope I was able to help you on how to play NBA 2023 with a PS4 controller. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.